There's this stabbing feeling that some people have. The first thing that when they get out of bed in the morning and they put the heel down and it's awful and sometimes even it just lasts all day. Uh, I've had it once in my life. I never want to have it again. Plantar fasciitis. It is. What is that? It's horrible. And it's awful. Olga, you're lucky that you've only had it once. I've had it a couple of times. You unfortunately, have. I have, I have, but uh, thankfully I'm better now. We have a 3D image actually of plantar. How did you say it, doctor, with your plantar accent? Plantar fasciitis. Fasciitis. Let's take that real quick and have you walk over there. So this is a, a model of the foot. And if we look here, toes, back of the foot, and this is the calcaneus bone here, and this is the bottom of the heel pad. And there's a thick ligament down here called the plantar fascia and you see this ligament here. And it inserts right on the bottom of the heel bone there. And this is where when you walk, you put the pressure through. Plantar fasciitis is inflammation of that ligament as it inserts on the bone. So plantar fascia is the structure. Itis is inflammation. So it's inflammation of the plantar fascia insertion. And it is a terrible problem because it's incredibly difficult to get rid of. And it will cause pain every single step, every single day, right there where it inserts. Most patients complain of terrible pain the first couple of steps they take in the morning. They can eventually walk it off a little bit, but as the day goes on, the pain level increases again. Unfortunately, one of the biggest reasons is there is no reason, it's just bad luck. These things just happen. But there is a strong relationship between plantar fasciitis and tightness of the plantar fascia ligaments and tightness of the Achilles tendon as well. And they are the two biggest predisposing factors to developing this problem and the problem will not go away until you solve those two factors, tight plantar fascia, tight Achilles tendon. And that's why the number one treatment modality for this problem is physical therapy, physical therapy, physical therapy. And not just therapy two or three times a week for an hour, it's therapy every single day. So you need a home exercise program to stretch both the Achilles tendon and the plantar fascia. You need to be doing it three times a day, 10 minutes every single time, as well as your formal therapy. I can promise that if you don't commit to that, the problem will not improve. If you do commit to that, the problem will improve, but unfortunately, sometimes it can take months and months to get better.